Uh, my name is Will Carter. I play inside linebacker, and I'm a fifth-year senior. It was the fourth game of the season last year, of the 2012 season. Uh, we were facing Utica, uh, beginning of the second quarter. Uh, it was a run play, tossed the outside. I was playing inside linebacker. I got chop blocked, which means an uh, offensive lineman dove at my legs. My left knee hyperextended. I had a partially torn ACL, partially torn PCL, partially torn posterior lateral corner, and bone fractures. So it was uh, a lot going on down there. Uh, the injury itself was pretty painful. Um, was really upset mentally because I found out pretty quickly that I wasn't going to be able to play that season, and you know possibly my football career was done. Uh, so that was definitely tough for me mentally. I started started rehabbing as soon as possible, as soon as I could, literally the next day, um, doing everything I could, doing everything I was allowed to do. Um, it progressed from you know just being able to flex my quad to walking in a pool, standing up in a pool on my own, uh, doing a lot of stuff. Uh, the trainers did something with me every day. You know, I was trying to get at least, as I got stronger, I was trying to get at least four hours of rehab a day. So it was a lot for me. It was a lot, uh, a lot, of, lot of taxing on the body, but I was able to get through it. And uh, I'm, glad, I'm glad I put myself through that because it ended up paying off. Um, so then, the decision came on whether or not to have surgery or not. Uh, there was, I talked to, total I talked to like four surgeons, talked to four different surgeons. Three of them, you know, when they first saw the MRI, assumed, immediately told me I was gonna have to have surgery, which is not something I wanted because I knew, well, it's not something I didn't want, it was just I knew that having surgery would, would make my recovery a lot less, or a lot less faster. Um, I still rehab, still didn't make up my mind. I still rehabbed very heavily, um, trying to prove to myself and prove to the doctors that I didn't need surgery. And eventually, I had a surgeon that I went with in New York City, who was actually also the surgeon for the New York Giants, um, ended up, you know, saying that if you're capable of doing this right now, you know, I don't think you're going to need surgery. You're not 100% out of the woods, but we need to see how you progress. Um, so I continued to work really hard. You know, four hours a day, um, at the, no no days off, absolutely four hours a day. There was no way I wasn't going to get four hours of treatment in, whether it was school, whether it's because, you know, not going out with friends. Um, There's absolutely no excuses. So I really pushed myself and eventually got cleared for spring ball. And that's how it all started. Uh, then I got my eligibility, and I was just real thankful for everything that happened.